It's that time of year when the holiday spirit fills the air, but as WYFF News 4's Myra Ruiz reports, so do some other things that could dampen festivities. According to the Centers for Disease Control, December could be a month when the flu season peaks, but a lot of people are more focused on spreading holiday cheer, not the germs. Most people are expecting to glide through the holiday season without a hitch, but some wise moms know that's not always possible. Well, with a bunch of kids, I definitely there's germs in our house all the time. Doctors keep talking about ways to keep sickness from spreading, and even the kids are listening. We wash our hands. Yeah, good. How often do you wash your hands? Um, about two times a day. <laughs> or maybe more? Uh, maybe more. And if you're coughing, keep loved ones close to your heart, not close by. You go in a different room if they're sick. Indoor air specialist Stan Sullivan says it's best to clear the air before inviting a crowd. And then you have guests coming in that might not be used to your home environment, whether as pets. Change all your filters uh, on whatever uh, machines that you're using, whether it's an air purifier or a dehumidifier, and especially on your HVAC systems. And along with that, I highly recommend to have your ducks cleaned about this time of the year. Beware of what you're breathing. He wants to eat that, I think. <laughs> How about that? Is that clean? And eating. Well, we usually try to label all our cups so that everybody's not drinking out of the same cup accidentally. I and mean, we keep lots of hand sanitizer around and only dip once with a chip. That's what we try to do. Tis the season to try to stay healthy. Myra Ruiz, WYFF News 4.